Hi there, Leos. This is Astro Girl, and thanks so much for tuning in for March 3 through 9. And just as we welcome Mercury back to the fold, Mercury, the planet of communication and clear thinking, moving direct in your relationship zone, we have to say adieu for a while to Mars, the planet of energy in your third house of busy activity, siblings, neighbors, and that's going to be out of phase through mid-May. And Saturn, the planet of focus and discipline, going out of phase in your home and domestic zone through mid-July. On the forward-moving front, Jupiter moves forward in Cancer, the 12th house of past karma, self-renewal, subconscious. So opportunities that maybe came up and you didn't take because they sounded too good to be true or you weren't in a position to take them at the time, or you are, you know, chasing a boy or a girl around the world and, you know, you weren't available. It's going to come back this, this, this time in the next couple of months. And this time you will seize the day. Jupiter moves into your sign mid-July after it leaves Cancer. So this is a nice build-up now to that time when you have Jupiter in your sign, which is going to be a wonderful time for you. And I think a time for you to really think about what it is that you want to do with your life in many ways. You only have Jupiter in your sign for a year, once every 12 years. So think back 12 years. Where were you? What were you doing? And what were you thinking of and aspiring to, Leos? And that'll probably give you a little bit of an indication of the power of Jupiter and where you should be headed. And this is a time for you, as a fire sign, to really mix it up and mingle with Mercury, the planet of chit-chat, in your relationship zone. One-on-one -on -one relationships, you've got a lot to get out of them at this time. Thanks so much for calling. Thanks so much for tuning in. I look forward to speaking to you again next week, Leo's.